Yo, Facebook, how you doing? I'll just wait a little bit until I see someone come up, but uh, it's been a few uh, a few weeks since I've done a Facebook Live like this on a Tuesday night. I endeavoured to do one like every single um, every single uh, what's it called week for a while, but I've been on holidays for a little bit, so. Here it is, I'm doing my third one here now. I've got, I have just love sharing this sort of information with people. So I've got a couple of special guests I'm gonna bring on tonight as well. But, um, but look, let's get into it. What's, uh, let me just explain a few things first about what we're doing here tonight. Um, what's this call all about? It's about ketones, ketosis, and keto max. Hey Timbo, how you doing mate? Um, so basically, feel free to engage in the call, comment, ask any questions, we'll do our best to, uh, to answer them uh, over a period of time when we're doing it. But um, first up, what I'll do is, um, for those of you that know me, I'll just give you a, a little bit of a rundown on who I am. Uh, my name's Brad Rasmus. I've been a health pro for, uh, for about 24 years now, holistic health pro. And, uh, and essentially prior to July 2016, uh, before I discovered one of these, these things we're gonna be talking about, uh, I was pretty anti-supplement for about 10 of those years. Because my primal approach um, has always been about the what's called building a boat analogy, where I'd rather get people to understand that it's more important to build a boat out of quality wood um, and average nails rather than rotten wood and golden nails, where the wood represents like quality, good, organic food, and, uh, and nails represent vitamins and minerals. Um, but after using this Keto OS or Keto Max product for a few days, it just, I couldn't believe how I felt. And I felt, I thought that if I, being as anal as I was with food and uh, the way I looked after my body, if I felt the best that I'd had in a long time and slept the best that I'd had and, uh, and I didn't feel like a slave to the Tupperware container over those three days, uh, yeah, I just thought, fire out, there's a lot of people who need to know about this. Um, I'm 41 now, I'm feeling pretty good. Um, and, um, but let me give you a little, little bit of a summary on what ketones and ketosis are. I'm actually going to put some links below as well, like a video, a short little three minute video, uh, a couple of little images and things like that. It'll explain exactly what I'm about to say as well. But for those people that need to hear it, like I do, then I'll just explain a little bit more. So basically ketones are our, our native fuel. They're an extremely long lasting, efficient energy source that's produced by our liver from our fat cells. Okay, when you haven't had many carbohydrates for an extended period of time. Okay, ketosis is when you have an elevated level of these ketones in your blood, specifically when it's higher than what's called 0.5 millimoles per liter. And there's two ways to get into ketosis. You can do it naturally via what's called ketogenesis uh, or nutritional ketosis essentially. And that's where your liver produces these ketones from your fat and to naturally create them, you can be in a state of starvation or you can eat a ketogenic diet. Both are pretty, they're pretty challenging to do, that's for sure. Or you can do what's called drink exogenous ketones. Exogenous is just a fancy word that means outside the body. Um, and essentially these things were originally made for Navy SEALs and for NASA astronauts. And I'll put a little image in into the comments later on that will explain a little bit more about that. So why would anyone want to ever even think about doing a ketogenic lifestyle diet, drink exogenous ketones or any of these sorts of things? It's because these are the benefits that you get from leading a ketogenic lifestyle or using a ketogenic supplement like our Keto Max product. So if there's any particular things that you guys see here right there that you'd like to know more about, like if there's any particular benefits you'd rather experience more than the others, just type it in below, like comment below, and um, a relevant person will get back in contact with you to give you more information about that, okay? So what we're gonna do now is gonna bring on a couple of different guests. The first person I'm gonna bring on is a person named Donna Marie Hurst. So I'm just gonna look for her here now and see if I can add her on nice and easy. Uh, sorry, just hold on one sec, guys. Donna Marie, invite. And, whoa. Oh. Sorry guys, rotate your phone, oh man, this is really annoying, sorry guys, oh there it is, okay, got it done there, so I just added Donna Marie to it, I'll just go back, there she is here, bring Donna Marie on camera, okay, from Melbourne, Melbourne, Australia, and she's been using Keto Max for about seven months now. Donna Marie, you've just got to push the button that this is her first time getting on doing this. 
there'll be a button that'll come up on your screen saying, come on, you have to turn your phone though 90 degrees. So just jump on there. But basically she's been using the product for about seven months, but she's had a long history of going specifically to Bali to go and do a whole heap of intermittent fasting and long fasts. She's sort of got a, a big, a big um, what's it called, uh, background in all of this sort of stuff before she even tried the, uh, the product out. She declined it. Okay, so <laughs> thanks for that there, Donna Marie. Let me add Tim on here first, and then we'll do Donna Marie afterwards. So Timbo, I'm going to add you on now, mate. Timbo's done these a few times, so he'll know how to add himself on. Tim is from Adelaide, South Australia. And, uh, and he's been using the product now, the Keto OS product, for about 15 months. And he's loved it that much. He's told about 140 of his friends about it. And uh, Timbo, how are you, mate? Good, mate. How are you doing, man? Yeah, awesome. Really good to, to have you here, mate, to be able to share what this stuff's uh, done for you as well. Um, we'll get straight into it so we don't waste too much uh, of people's time on a, on a uh, Tuesday night. But... I'll just ask you a few questions, if that's cool, mate, and you just share honestly with what, uh, what it's done for you. No worries, mate. Go for gold. Let's do this. All right. Awesome. Well, basically, yeah, what I want to sort of know is um, – uh, oh, hold on one sec. Sorry, mate. Tell me about um, when, you first, uh, when you first were introduced to the product. Give us, give us the rundown. Where, where did you hear about it? Who gave it to you? Well, yeah, 15 months ago now, um, a friend of mine had actually just uh, started using the product herself. And she knew that I had tried a ketogenic diet in the past. And uh, she said to me, hey, you know, what do you know about ketones and ketosis? Um, you know, check this you know, short video out, which I'm sure a few people watching this may have seen before. Um, check this video out, let me know what you think. So this friend of mine from Adelaide, um, you know, like I said, I tried a ketogenic diet in the past and uh, it didn't last all that long because it was a uh, difficult and grueling task to get my body into a state of ketosis with the low amount of carbohydrates, which I was, I won't even say consuming because I barely was consuming any carbohydrates whatsoever. And I think the week that I attempted that, I was feeling pretty bloody low. Like I knew the benefits of ketosis. I'd done a lot of research, a lot of reading into it. I knew the capability which a keto diet had, uh, but that first week just completely put me off. So when she said to me, you know, what do you know about ketones and ketosis? I said, look, I've tried this uh, a few months ago now, absolutely hated it. What have you got to show me? And she said, check this video out. Um, all the benefits of ketones, drink it simply. You get all the benefits within 60 minutes of taking this thing. I thought, no way. Like I put myself through a week and only a week. I know people that have put themselves through a few weeks to try and get themselves into a state of ketosis through that ruling diet over a number of days or weeks, wherever it is. But I watched the video and I thought, all right, I need to try and get my, I need to get my hands on this stuff and see if this is, this is the real deal. So that was uh, 15 months ago now that I was introduced to the, the concept of exogenous ketones. That's cool. So what did it actually then initially do for you then? Like, what did you feel? What benefits did you get? Well, I guess prior to experimenting with, with ketones, I was a very like, terrible, I couldn't get to sleep at night. I'd be rolling around, staring at the roof for um, you know, one or two hours, could not get to sleep. And that was frustrating. So I don't know if there's anybody watching this that maybe has those same similar issues, maybe chuck out, I don't know, a, a, a sleeping emoji up, for example. Uh, but I, I really, really struggled to get to sleep at night. It was quite, quite annoying, you know that lack of motivation to get up for work in the morning. And then the other thing which I struggled with because of my lack of sleep at night, I'd uh, you know go to work, get through the morning and hit sort of 12, 31 o'clock in the afternoon. I'm thinking, shit, like it's at five o'clock yet, yeah, I want to go home. Couldn't get through my day and just a real struggle to sort of push through. So I'd be relying on uh, you know coffees to get me through the day or snacking on Mars bars. I do, did have quite an addiction to Mars bars. Um, so snacking on Mars bars, drinking coffees, you know, three or four coffees a day started drinking uh, exogenous ketones and the one the first drink that i had um had it in the morning and got to around about two o'clock in the afternoon and i thought shit i haven't even eaten yet had not even eaten until like that afternoon i thought you know where's all this energy coming from hadn't need to didn't need to stop and snack on a um a mars bar hadn't needed any coffees i thought geez this stuff's pretty bloody powerful so i guess in the first 24 hours that's what I noticed from the get-go. That well, that first twelve hours, rather, is the longest. You know, that long sustained energy throughout the morning. 
And then to further on from that, that night, I hit the sack and lights out. Amazing sleep and, you know, haven't looked past it. It's been every day has been, um, you know, the same sense. And just quickly, Brett, I might just add, last week I shared a post um, on a page about, uh, because I've been using ketones now for quite a long time, and I've, you know, got used to the energy that I get and the amazing sleep which I do get from this product. I thought I'd just take a couple of days out and experiment without ketones and see how my body responded to that. And, uh, yeah, so I think it was last Wednesday or Thursday, I can't remember the exact day, but four coffees, mate. Four coffees last Wednesday or Thursday, whatever day it was, to get me through. And I was struggling, struggling. So I had to get, yeah, on that Friday, wow. it was like, all right, I'm back onto it. I need to get these ketones running through my body. Wow, that's full on, man. Like, look, I, I understand now the uh, the love, the addiction that people have with coffee because I've never loved it. I just don't want to, I don't like it in the feeling of it. But I have that feeling now with ketones. If I don't have them, it, it you know, it's, uh, I, I really do feel the difference too. So, uh, so the fact that you, yeah, one day of not having it and you had to have four coffees, man, that's, uh, that's pretty full on. Bloody hell. Is there anything else that's those those doing four... for you now? So because of those Sorry. four coffees, because of those four coffees, I couldn't actually sleep that night either. So it was back to that old process of before, back to that lack of sleep. So it was a terrible experience have, coming off those ketones. Sorry, mate, go wow. on what you were saying. I was just going to say, are there any other particular things then that you've noticed it's been doing for you? Like, is it still working? Consider well, I guess it was, considering it's been 15 months since you first started using it. You, you are obviously noticing that it's still, uh, it's still working. Yeah, definitely. I think, you know, I've experimented quite a bit with the product as well. You know, I started out with just having it first thing in the morning. Um, now I'll have it, you know, first thing in the morning. I'll have it before a workout to really fuel my workouts. I'll have a, you know, I'll have one before bed as well just to really, you know, enjoy that sleep. Um, I just love experimenting with the products. There's so many different ways that you can utilize the product to get all these benefits when you just showed the box before. And I think, you know, the powerful thing for myself is that I've loved this product that, that much. And it's changed, you know, my energy levels significantly. It's improved my sleep significantly that, you know, I've felt the need to go out there and, you know, and spread and share this ketone conversation with people that, you know, need that energy or they need that better sleep or um, you just want to become, you know, fitter, healthier, better versions of themselves. So this is something which, like I said, 15 months now, and it's something which I'm going to continue to, you know, use day in, day out because it's um, dramatically changed my life. And I want to spread and share this conversation as far and wide as possible. That's cool, man. No, I feel the same way. Yeah, if you're a mate of, uh, of Timbo's and you're watching this, um, yeah, contact him afterwards if you want to try some of them out. It's, uh, it's pretty awesome stuff. Well, mate, thanks very much for sharing that. I appreciate uh, you spending your time there tonight with, uh, with uh, getting the word out there. And um, let's now hope that Donna Marie knows how to uh, push the buttons to get herself on there. But if you could take yourself off, then I'll, uh, I'll, I'll uh, attempt to add her again. So, Donna Marie, I'm just going to add you now. And let's see if we can get you on board. Just clicked on the button there saying adding now. And click on the blue button, just sending her a message. Hopefully she hasn't run away, being her first time and all. But if she does, then so be it. I'll have to teach her again and we'll get her on another time. But uh, Donna Marie, are you there? Like, comment below to let me know whether or not you are still hearing me. If you're not, not a problem, then we'll, uh, we'll finish up and then I'll, uh, I'll do this another time with you. But I hope you guys at least enjoyed hearing from, uh, from Tim King there. There's, that's just one of a gazillion different stories. And Tim's not this, but he's not a, an example of someone who has this amazing before and after picture and all this sort of stuff like a lot of you might have seen with other people sort of sharing the ketone story. Um, you know, it's just, it does a lot of different things for different people, especially for, for brain, brain cognition, like just, you, there's a gazillion different things you can look up now from a scientific perspective to talk about the ketogenic lifestyle and the use of exogenous ketones as well. And I'll sh share a lot more of that sort of stuff, uh, below. Oh, hold on. I can see Donna Marie's just saw what my, what I said. Donna Marie, are you going to jump on board or not? <laughs> Cause we've got a few people waiting here. We've got 15 people now. You really need to hear what she's got to say because this stuff sucked. It, she did not like it at all at the very beginning. So why is she still using it seven months later? 
It didn't give me a blue button that time. Okay, so I'm gonna send, I'm gonna send it again. Can you hear me? Let me just send you a quick message there now. Okay, Donna Marie, sorry that first comment was supposed to be hello. Okay, so I've just added you again, so click on it now. Can you see it now? Hopefully she will get on in a second. If not, then I will just I will finish this call and uh, thank you very much for uh, for jumping on, guys, and uh, and listening. Donna Marie, are you there? No, I think she's having some problems. Okay, that's cool. Well, look, Timbo, thanks so much for getting on there before, mate, and sharing your story. And if I can get uh, Donna Marie to to jump on board. Then, um, then I'll I'll just jump back on and do another live. Why not? So, uh, but these things happen, don't they, guys? Sometimes we just have issues, technological issues. Ah, oh, thanks, Shelley. Yeah, I do like my shirt too. Um, all right, no worries. Well, look, um, since she's not coming on there now, I will uh, I'll say good night there, guys, and I'll hopefully be back on in a few more minutes. Actually, I'll leave you guys to it. Have a good one.